Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of the Umrah vlog series. We are going to be performing Umrah today, so we're heading out to Masjid Aisha to assume Ihram. In order to assume Ihram, if you're already in Mecca, you will have to leave the boundaries of Mecca by going to the nearest one, which is Masjid Aisha. That's where you can go ahead and assume Ihram to perform Umrah. Here I'm just doing one last outfit check before I head out. I think it looks good, so let's go. So after breakfast, we head downstairs to our hotel and got a taxi to Masjid Aisha. We were charged around 100 rial, which I think it's about $27 at the time. So our taxi driver took us to Masjid Aisha and then waited for us to swim Ihram there and then took us right back to our hotel. It was amazing. If you're entering by plane or other means of transportation from Saudi Arabia, you may have to assume Ihram at the nearest Miqat. But because we had entered into Mecca a few days ago, we had to leave the boundary of the Haram and made our way to Masjid Aisha, which is the nearest Miqat to the Haram. At Masjid Aisha, the women's facility is on the far right of the masjid. You will find a place to do wudu and also a place to actually take the bath before you assume ihram. performed our prayers and then we made our intention to perform Umrah for Allah's sake. Alhamdulillah, it was a good experience. And Masjid Aisha is really beautiful. 
recommend anyone to go there, even if you're not in Iran, like just go because it's a really beautiful place to visit. Once you are in Ihram, you are now able to recite the Talabiyah, and you recite the Talabiyah up until the moment you see the Kaaba and the Harem. We got back on our taxi ride back to the Harem, and then we were able to enter into um, the Kaaba. I would like to also say that before you um, perform Umrah, make sure you book your visit in the Nisuk app. Um, just so that the, if the guards or security do stop you before entering into the main area, you just show them your Nisuk app, you book that appointment to perform Umrah at that time. Words cannot describe what I'm feeling. To see the Kaaba in person, alhamdulillah. This is where all the struggle and everything, everything, alhamdulillah. I just, subhanallah.
Alright guys, I look like a mess, but we have two more rounds to go. And then we cut our hair, and then alhamdulillah, we finish. But first, let's get some Zamzam water. Guys, my face is sweaty, but we're now at Al Marwa Mountain. Alhamdulillah, we just finished Asai. Our mom is downstairs on the ground floor, so we're gonna head there to meet up with her, inshallah. But right now, it's actually raining in Mecca again. It rained yesterday, but today it's raining again, and we actually hit thunderstorms. It's loud, um, so we're gonna check it out real quick. Go inside. Let's go outside real quick to see it. We are currently relaxing after doing our sa'i and one thing to note is that they make sure this place is cool. Like there's like neither air conditioning, there's a lot of um, fans, ceiling fans blowing, so you feel cool despite the fact that I really was sweaty the whole time. Um, they have Zamzam water stations, I think every few, f every, it's like about a couple of them, fountains, um, on each side, Maura, like when you're going to Maura, when you're going to Safa, on each side there's some, so you can uh, fill your bottle of water with some Zamzam on your way. I did it a few times, some women are, are they bring in like 10 bottles and they're filling it. This one person has like a um, Tropicana orange juice that they are reusing to fill like complete with Dam Zam, so it's hilarious. Um, there's many stations, so if you're seeing a crowd of people on one station, just walk to the next one, it's not that far. Uh, and then you could fill in your bottle. Another thing to note is that it smells amazing here. Like it smells so good. I even may put like perfume in the vents of the masjid so when you're doing your sa'i you feel great because it's not only it's cool but it smells good you know alhamdulillah um so yeah we're gonna head out now to meet my mom inshallah um it is raining still we might do a uh, maghrib here um inshallah we'll, and then head from the hotel from there